Shalom, Chavri, my name is Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live here from Orlando, Florida. And the rain is coming down pretty heavy as some of these outer bands from Hurricane Irma have actually reached here up into Orlando. Uh, we have already been following the storm like many of you guys are following this as well. We, we realize uh, reports coming out from RT News and a lot of people on Twitter showing that the Bahamas, that the ocean had disappeared all around the Bahamas. Now keeping in mind, of course, the Bahamas is a very shallow water for goes out for, for a mile or so anyway. And uh, that water only about six, seven feet deep. But this, it shows the magnitude of this hurricane literally able to take the waters with it coming up, up through Cuba, across Cuba, weakened down the storm that was a Category 5 as it first approached, down to a Category 4 and then to a Category 3. Uh, it is expected though to gain strength as it's already crossed over the Keys now, headed towards southern Florida, and it looks like Fort Myers, the very city that we used to live in, in fact when Israeli News Live first began, that's where we lived at as well. It looks like the Fort Myers is going to catch the brunt of the wrath of Irma as it hits the mainland United States there. But uh, we're right now, actually I'm getting pretty wet now as the winds are blowing the water here inside the parking garage in the apartment facility here where we're living at there. Uh, but it is, it looks like it's going to have a pretty good punch even here for Orlando as it makes landfall and as it heads up into the Tampa area that it's expected to be a Category 3 when it hits Tampa. So we may get 85, 95 mile an hour winds here in Orlando and of course I better get on a rain suit if I'm going to continue to cover this. Uh, but uh, we are here in Orlando, Florida covering Hurricane Irma as it makes its way against the West Florida coast there. We're going to catch it, whether it's east or west, either one, we're definitely going to catch this storm. Uh, anyway, we also seen the, the, the storm surge that came up into Miami. A lot of downtown Miami was also flooded. As you can see, some of the images we're sharing here with you here. And I am getting soaked as that wind blows that rain under this canopy. Oh my gosh. Anyway, it's kind of quiet here for a little bit there. And then this storm kind of blew in from one of the uh, bands there, which kind of helped pick up the winds pretty considerably here. But I can only imagine here in the next hours here, uh, by nightfall especially, we're going to probably see some pretty hefty winds blowing from Hurricane Irma. I'm Stephen Benoom with Israeli News Live. Shalom.